Why? Why? 10 minutes from the track and it started snowing. What the hell is up with this weather? Damn. What the hell, mom? I <laughs> Good days of training in France in the sand and I'm feeling ready for the weekend so now we are heading back to Belgium need to clean everything then we are heading to the track of Valkenswart for the next GP this weekend tomorrow so uh, yeah I'm really excited and I'm feeling ready Are you jealous? 
Good morning here from round two of the world championship here in Valkensvart, MSGP of the Netherlands. It's a really muddy weekend, I think. Another muddy weekend, as you could see uh, yesterday's track walk. Uh, the roots were pretty deep after just walking the track, so I think uh, it's going to be a difficult day. But hopefully, the track. Uh, improves session by session today is training time qualifying and qualifying race so excited for that now it's time to head out for training now in the morning so uh, just getting changed and uh, ready to head out Just now getting ready for the qualifying race, just did uh, training and time practice. The training was okay, I didn't uh, actually put down a lap or anything, but I think I was 25. I just rode around and tried to get as many laps in as possible. And then in the time practice I knew that the track would change really fast because it's quite muddy still. So I just hammered down from the first uh, lap. First lap I had a quite a good time, but on the fourth lap I had a better time, so that was my best lap, was on the fourth lap, and that gave me a 13th position. After 5-6 laps uh, it was difficult to jump the jumps and everything, because it's really muddy, so hopefully the track stays a little bit uh, in a better shape for motos, but I'm not sure. But yeah, anyway, just going to go out and try to push all the moto and uh, then we will end up where we end up. So uh, yeah, just getting changed now. It's about 50 minutes till I ride. So yeah, let's go. <laughs> So qualifying race is just done. It was a decent one riding wise but unfortunately had a technical issue in the end there so finished 36th, not the best for tomorrow. On the start I uh, had a good release over the gate but tangled with another rider on the straight so went uh, about lost into the turn or something. I think exiting the turn I was around 25 maybe and uh, on the first lap I got up to 17 had some great lines and uh, passed a lot of riders so happy with my riding there 
I was steadily chipping away there so I think I got up to like 15th or so when unfortunately one guy came around on the outside going to pass me he touched me and uh, I fell so a little bit of a scratch here and uh, just because he hit me not because I crashed so yeah after that I picked myself up lost like two three position nothing much but uh, was keen to push to try to get uh, into the top top uh, 15 again so then I struggled a little bit with arm pump because I pushed maybe a little bit too hard and I started making too many mistakes and also crashed one more time then after that I was riding P30 I think and uh, unfortunately had the technical issues so just looking forward to tomorrow now so uh, hoping that tomorrow is a better day what do you uh, think you have a cold beer and now you're happy <laughs> yeah that's all anything I need <laughs> <laughs> but uh, the riding Oh, I think the riding was pretty good today. So, happy with that. We meet you downstairs in the bar and heard your rolled up sleeves and your skull t shirts. Said, what did you do with him today? Then sniffed me out like I was Tanqueray Cause you're my fella, my guy I'm the Ostella of fly By the time I'm out the door You tear me down like Roger Moore I cheated myself This is when my buzzer goes Run out to meet your chips of bitter You say when we marry cause you're not bitter There'll be none of him no more I cried for you on the kitchen floor I cheated myself Difficult weekend once again, what a crazy track and what a crazy race. In the first race I uh, had a bad start, as you could see I also had a small crash there. I didn't crash but I was stuck a little bit, so I was around 30 on the first lap and also the first laps, in both motos actually, I was really cautious and rode really slow. 
I didn't want to crash the first lap because that gives you such a disadvantage. Struggling on the first laps, I, when I got going, I started struggling with the Googles. In both motos, I needed to go inside and change the Googles. And uh, also, in the second race, when I changed the Googles, uh, I stole the bike. So that gives me a few seconds of disadvantage. And yeah, in the end of the first race and also in the end of the second race, I uh, rode the best. The last 10 minutes was uh, the best I rode in the whole moto, I think, in both motos, actually. So I don't know why, but then I started to push more and didn't care so much about the position or to crash. I just wanted to finish and finish the best as I could. So I started pushing pushing without a care in the world, you know, so yeah, I got up to 18th in both motos, that was also the goal after the Saturday to get points in both motos, because in England I got points in one moto, next step is points in both, and then hopefully the next step after that is uh, two times top 15 or one time top 15 or points in both motos, but one moto top 15, I think, that's the goal and step by step we increase the goal and hopefully we can get closer and closer to the top in the end of the season so I'm really excited for Argentina one weekend off now so we're going to do some training and hopefully make me stronger and better and faster and everything so but yeah that's it for this video I think I hope you have enjoyed it we got a lot of good riding and step by step we have better results I finished four motos so far so I'm happy with that and uh, Hopefully I can continue on that streak as long as possible. That's the goal every time I go to, into the moto to finish the race and push as hard as I can. And then the results come after that. So hope you have enjoyed this video. And until next time, remember to keep full gas. See you soon. Bye. Oi. <laughs>